Okay, in this video we're going to compare. I have a dialed-in limited edition and a dialed-in standard edition. The uh, standard edition is on the right-hand side and the limited edition is on the left-hand side. Um, one of the things, just looking at it from the front, um, you can notice the blue powder coat on the LE and uh, versus the standard uh, metal and also just by looking at the front you can tell by the it's got the uh, headphone jack and there's no headphone jack on the uh, standard edition so what else is different <clears throat> if you look at both the play fields uh, they're pretty much the same the the standard has a high quality uh, clear coat on it um, and so does the LE uh, but one of the glaring differences is and, I, and to me it's not really a big deal it just depends on the person in the game and if they really want to have it um, is these LEDs that go up the ramp right here. Um, that's probably one of the biggest things which is right here and wrapping around. And if you look at the standard edition it does not have that. Uh, there's no LEDs on this and in the back. So that's one of the main uh, differences. Uh, also there's little cosmetic differences, uh, nothing, nothing major. If you look at the Quantum th uh, Theater, uh, it's kind of a, it's a 2D plastic, just a regular plastic. And if you look at the Quantum Theater plastic on this, it's a 3D plastic. Um, so that might be a big deal to some people, but maybe not. If you're just playing pinball, it's really not that big of a deal. Um, trying to think of the other differences here. Uh, that's pretty much it as far as the differences go. Um, everything else is the same. The uh, drones uh, move. Uh, everything moves as it should. Everything operates as it should. There's really nothing uh, between the two that makes it that big of a deal when you're playing the game. Uh, the LEDs and the, and the difference in the um, uh, plastic on the quantum theater is really not that big of an issue. So if you want to save a thousand dollars it's uh, definitely a consideration. Now the LE also does come with Invisiglass. Um, I have both the sheets of glass off so you can't see that so uh, that's usually a $299 option so I'd take that into consideration also. So that's pretty much it. Hope this helps you make your decision.